Hey, 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 everybody, and happy, happy Sunday, fun day. I, um, yeah, totally forgot to go to church last night because I like going on Saturday nights, so went this morning, and Mom actually went with me, which is a shocker. She always says she's going to go, but then ends up watching it online, so, but we went. But today, Pastor Rick was not preaching. It was Pastor Judy, which was fun. We're just used to Pastor Rick, but hey, everybody's got to take a vacation, so I am going to run to Tan, and then I'm going to go to Ross, and then I'm going to go to Claire's, because I lost one of my nose rings last night, so he got knocked out in a makeout session. <laughs> I swear, y'all. I still, I can't get over that. I'm telling you. Like, I just, yeah. It's, it, it, yeah. It's crazy. Just the connection that we had. So, hopefully it stays. And, uh, I, originally I was like, oh, man, I haven't heard from him this morning. And so, I thought, well, I'll just go ahead and text him. And right in the middle of composing a text, he texted and said, good morning, beautiful. And I was like, oh, I was just texting you. See? And that's the reason I don't like liking people. I don't, I hate all this, oh, I, I hope I hear from him, or I hope he texts, I don't want to text him first, I don't like all that crap, like, no, so, that's why I'm just kind of ignoring it, and so, I just basically told him, you know, good morning to you too, I hope you have a great day today, and he was like, um, it'd be better if I was with you, I'm like, well, that could be arranged, <laughs> so, but he's actually doing something with his daughters, and so he was like, well, maybe if you're free later, I was like, yeah, just hit me up. But um, we had actually talked about going out on the Harley. Because um, I was like, um, are you going to take me out for a ride? And he was like, are you kidding? I'd love to have a beautiful woman like you on the back of my bike. And um, which I just thought was so sweet. But um, it's a little bit chilly. I mean, it's like 69 degrees. We had a quote, cold front come through. So, and it's windy. And so, yeah, I'd be freezing my butt off. I'm sure he wouldn't, but I would. So, today's probably a little bit too cold for that. But, um, anyway, so, ooh, gas dropped down even more, 249, so, I don't know, but yeah, and then, um, usually, he works Monday through Friday, um, but he's actually off tomorrow because of Memorial Day, but he is on call, so that means if the operating room needs him or an emergency comes up, he's got to go quick, so, um, but yeah, okay, I see you, Mustang, get out there, um, but yeah, and so, but he does have set hours, and then he's on call every so often for like trauma cases and ER cases and stuff that come up, so, but um, anyway, so that's pretty much that, but uh, we'll see what happens, so, like I said, only God knows, so we will see, but um, yeah, we just, like I said, we had a lot, lot, lot in common, and um, just there was definitely an attraction, but there needs to be more than, you know, just that physical attraction, so, but, I don't know. Don't really know what to say about it. It just is what it is, but definitely enjoyed myself, definitely had a good time, so, we will see, we will see, we will see, but I'm going to go tan get myself nice and darker, and go do a little shopping, the sun's trying to come out, yay, so, but, um, and then, um, yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out, I'm gonna have to basically deal with all this crap going on with Tim, him, like, basically saying, I'm coming over, two days in a row, he told me, I'm coming over, like, dude, you weren't invited over, no, you're not, and, uh, so that right there, like, that's pushing my boundaries, and I'm not, gonna tolerate that. I'm not gonna accept it under no circumstances. So since I tried to remain friends with him when I broke it off with him and he can't accept those boundaries, then our friendship is done. So like I'm yeah, I'm not even playing that crap. But nope, isn't gonna happen. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to uh, deal with that and how to handle that and let him know, you know, look, I tried to remain friends, tried to keep it civil, um but, you know, it's, it's like he's constantly still wanting to treat me like his girlfriend and 
like, no, I don't want to be his girlfriend. So, and now, because of the way he's acted, honestly, it's sad, but I don't even want to be friends with him now. So, I'm just kind of ignoring him for right now, but, um, and I'm sure he's going to have a conniption. I'm sure he's going to throw a fit, but, oh, well, he, he made it that way, not me. So, I don't know what else to say about it, but anyways, well, I'm going to go on and enjoy my day. I love you all. Hope everybody's having a beautiful and blessed Sunday fun day, and I'll be back, guys. Bye.